Live from Lawler Rink in North Andover, Massachusetts, it's Hockey East action as Merrimack takes on the University of Massachusetts. Taking a look at the goaltenders for tonight. For UMass, Cole Brady, a transfer from Arizona State. 1-0, 1,000 save percentage. Picked up a shutout in his opening start with the Minutemen. Hugo Olas down to our right. 6'8", 253 pounds, 1-3 with a 2.85 goals against and an 884 save percentage. Olas in the game last night made 16 saves as UMass won the opening game of the weekend. 3 to 2 at the Mullins Center. The puck is on the ice. We are underway here at Merrimack. UMass has, over the last few years, built a team that's had experience, been able to develop that experience, playing in big games, finding ways to win close games. And that's had an awful lot to do with it. UMass won the national championship a couple of years ago. Prior to that, they, when they first started, they had a five win season under Greg Carvel. Breakaway here, and it's a score for Reed Lebster off a block shot. Lebster breaks in alone, and he goes up top to beat Olas at 3.15. UMass takes the 1 0 lead. Well, Reed Lebster gets that puck, and he is off to the races. Goes right up ice, is able to get there between the dots and lift it past. Olas, you see how much he hustles here. He goes right between those two guys, and it's upstairs under the crossbar. Time of the goal is 3.15, and just like last night, UMass gets on the board first. On Reed Lebster's goal, it's 1-0. Welser clean win to Jeffries. He fires, hits a leg. Welser, follow-up, score! Mac Welser ties it after the shot by Jeffries was blocked, and Welser ties the game with 32 seconds left. You know, John, you can see from our angle up here, right where Welser was going to have some space just enough between the pad of Brady and the post. And you get a good look at it on this replay, too, I think. Jeffries, that shot is blocked. Welser gets it right there. And it is a goal. Merrimack finally gets on the board in the final minute of play to tie the game up. We're even up. It is 1-1. Third goal of the year for Mac Welsher. He's got three points on the weekend. UMass wins the faceoff. They get it to center. Big win by UMass. We're going to go to overtime for the second straight night. And Mike, four now of the last seven games between these two teams have gone to overtime. Comes up high to Demon. Demon holding, looking. Demon goes behind the goal. In front, they had a man there. And the pass doesn't connect. And Olas will come out of the goal. He'll play it away from Connors. <laughs> Dangerous pass there from Olas. The not, that far away from, not that far away from Connors. Now here's Brar into the offensive zone. Brar trying to get around his man. Brar to the goal. Score! Ben Brar wins it at 3.37 of overtime. UMass won it last night in overtime. Ben Brar wins it for the Warriors in overtime tonight. And they snap the streak of six straight. One by UMass, six straight, one goal wins. Tonight it's Merrimack. You see the excitement on their part. Ben Brar carrying the puck in here. He's going to carry it all the way right out in front, score so many of his goals from there. And that time he's able to get around the D and cut right in front with enough space to put that one past Brady, who's played so well tonight. But that time Ben Brar got the best of him. Time of the goal, 337. Ben Brar will get his third goal of the year, and it's the game winner as Merrimack wins in overtime 2-1. And UMass will taste defeat for the first time in 2021-22. The Minutemen will drop to 5-1-1. One, one. Merrimack goes to 4-3 and three overall. John, what a great series this weekend between these two teams. Both teams worked hard and battled hard both nights. They're going to each come away, I guess, with a split on the weekend. Feels deserved. But for Merrimack, the way that it went, and after having tasted defeat so often against UMass, to get this one tonight certainly is going to feel sweet to them. Boston College in town Thursday. We'll have it for you right here on ESPN+. Plus. So, Merrimack now.
now with the victory. They go to four and three, UMass to five, one and one. So, for my broadcast partner, Mike Macknick, producer KJ Cardinal, and our entire Pack Network crew, I'm John Leahy saying so long from North Andover. The final score in overtime, Merrimack two, Massachusetts one. All games airing on the ESPN networks are streaming live and archived on the ESPN app. This has been a presentation of ESPN.